So this is pretty exciting. Indigo has gone into labor. This video may not be for the squeamish. It shows the goat birth process. We knew she looked pregnant, but we weren't quite convinced that she was gonna have babies because she went past the due date when, you know, mathematically she should have had the babies already. Indigo was about two weeks overdue. Anyway, Whitty's got some some things together, so we'll be here to observe and assist if necessary. How you doing, Indigo? Don't shout. Talk in a quiet Brian voice, not a shouting at the camera Brian voice. Because you're already loud. Trust me. Okay. All the goats want to help. So we're not real. We're not real sure exactly how long this process is going to take. Goats usually give birth pretty easily. We don't expect to have to do a whole lot. Fingers crossed it goes better than it did the last time. It's already going better because there's not a tree on my barn. <laughs> I mean, seriously, you wanna... things could be worse. <laughs> You want to describe what that was like? No, I don't want to describe what that was like. It was crazy. It was pretty crazy. It was Valentine's Day night, and we had a massive ice storm. Trees were hitting our house, falling all over the property. Valkyrie went into labor. We got two goats. The third goat, unfortunately, didn't make it. Hopefully it goes better this time. Okay, can we stop making video now and so that I can concentrate on my goat? Oh my goat. <laughs> How you doing, Sienna? You got a little while before you go through this. Indigo has given birth before. We bought her as a milk goat. She's she's pushing. I can see a little foot. see a little something coming out. Foot. Oh. Oh. It's a little gross looking. I'm not sure if you really I'm not sure if you really want to see it. But let's take a look. It went back in. Are these your farmer terms. <laughs> the gross thing. It it's, went back in. It's kinda icky, but it's it's the way things are. It'll take as long as it does. We're just sort of in a waiting game right now. I'd say the whole goat birth process took a little less than an hour. Much better. Good job. Keep going. Keep pushing. My nose. My nose. Keep going. You're doing good, baby. You're doing good. Okay. Good girl. Yeah, good girl. 
so not much. Oh. Oh, there's the hoof again. Yeah. She's not stretching out very much. Two hooves are emerging. <laughs> Indigo is just going to take as long as she needs to. the world. Welcome to the world. Well, that's distinctive. <laughs> Whose baby would that be? Long years like that. Yeah. This is a Nubian Nigerian dwarf mix. So we were really curious what the goat would look like. We're happy to see it's got Indigo's ears. You think there's just the one or more to come? I don't know. Boy. It's a boy? Yep. <coughs> well, we were hoping for girls. It's okay. He's a big boy. That's pretty colors. I think this is probably a striker baby. With all that brown gray color. You can stand up if you want to. Just tell your mom to stop licking you. She's doing a good job. She's a good mama. This one's got some pretty markings. Baby number two. 
Welcome to Ivy Acres girl. Homestead. And it's a girl. Yay. All right, that's what we were hoping for. <laughs> she's pretty. She's got a really pretty, yeah, pretty set is. of marks on her. She's beautiful. She looks well, she's... just like her mommy with the forehead. Look at her forehead, Brian. <laughs> just like Indigo. This one will probably be a keeper. <laughs> that beautiful little goatee. <laughs> it's kind of struggling a little bit. Yeah. Come here, Bubba. A little brother and a little sister, just like Valkyries. You want to stand up, don't you? You can stand up. Come on. Oh, almost. There you go. Yay, standing on your own. Well, don't lick. <laughs> That's not to lick. Come here. Ears. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Yay for babies. <laughs> this makes 12 goats. It's a little too many goats. <laughs> Don't say it so loud the neighbors might hear. <laughs> It's kind of curious if we made a newbie looking goat with blue eyes. Because both our boys have blue eyes, I think. I'm pretty sure. I can't remember now. One of them does. <laughs> So the little goats haven't nursed yet, but they're doing really well. They're making cute little squeaky noises. That's probably my mom texting back after I sent her a couple pictures. 
Yeah, let's see what she says. Mom says, oh my gosh, that's crazy. Five baby goats in one week. Just let her come over here if she wants. Mm -hmm. She seems to suck when she's behind her mama. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. Mm -hmm. Come here, Indigo. Look. Look. It's your baby. It's your baby. So we brought Indigo back here to milk her to get some of the precious colostrum that the babies really need to drink right away. She's so engorged. Wendy is now, of course, feeding that to our little goats. Good girl. Oddly enough, they weren't drinking mm -hmm. until Indigo got a little closer. Mm -hmm. So I think that's helping the goats, little baby goats, know what to do. Is that good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Belly's starting to work. Mm -hmm. Tell us all about it, Indigo. How do you really feel?
Give him some legs. He's very wiggly. He's very wiggly. Come here. I'm sorry. Gotta open your mouth. There. Okay. Come on. Drink like your sister was drinking, please. Come on. He goes, you're looking mean. <laughs> Not helpful. <laughs> he basically had to close his mouth over there. There you go. Good boy. Brilliant. Fuzzy thing is right up my nose. <laughs> Long day. This is just always the worst part is making sure that they are alive, <laughs> that they get some, some colostrum in them. So it makes me really anxious. I don't want to do it wrong or make a wrong decision. <laughs> we think. Is that good? <laughs> they are really vocal with each other. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. Parker was like that too. Let me see first. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Eat a little more. Eat a little more. Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> <laughs> she just keeps wanting to lick me. She's so silly. Probably got enough goo on you. You smell hey, like hey, the goats. Don't eat the begonias. A little, little less stressful now, Wendy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? What just happened? Indigo released her placenta. It's not pretty. Yeah, you don't have to see everything to imagine what that looks like. Good job, Indigo. Big day for you. We milked off quite a bit more of the colostrum and Wendy's gonna freeze it just in case we need it later. Always good to be prepared. Just make a video with the goat birth and don't show the rest of this stuff because this is too cute to include with the goat birth video. Your goat birth video will be dem demonetized. Okay, that's fine. Well, it'll all work out. We've got plenty of goat, cute goats for all the videos. Well, they're particularly cute when they're running up and down. Where'd they go? <laughs> hey! Where's my baby? <laughs> <laughs>